Reaper is incredibly powerful, and it's now coming into its own with connecting with middleware for video games like Wise or FMOD. And here's an example of how I think it's incredibly powerful for both dialogue and sound designers in opening sessions based on the file. So in this session, let's, let's name this testing one, two, three, and we'll save the session. And then we'll export this file and we'll export the item. And one very special feature here in Reaper is we can include project file name in BWF data. That's very important. So we save this, we render this file. Uh, we'll show it in the folder over here. That's great. Um, and then just to give you the full power of this test, I'm gonna zoom in way over here. You can see I saved it. There's nothing over here. We'll close that session. So I wrote a script that looks at that BWF data to see what project it came from. And then it goes further than that. So with right clicking, um, and I just have it to send to because it's easy to do that in Windows. So I have it to the send to, which initiates a Python script, which then goes into Reaper. And this is outside of Reaper. It opens Reaper, opens a project, opens the project that this file came from, then finds the file, zooms in, and highlights the file. Incredible. So essentially with FMOD, with WISE, with any of this middleware, you can just right click and press open the project in Reaper. Amazing. The features, this is just like the tip of the iceberg of how Reaper can connect with video game middleware.